Hi folks, this is Tasty Bento, and here I am playing my B Sky block game. And you can see I'm on my island, and I've got my cow, and I've got a whole load of commands like uh, challenges, and I can uh, get my island level. And yeah, here we go. So this is a fully functioning skyblock server but how do you get to this point point? and what I'm going to show you in this video is how to set up your B skyblock server and acid island server if you want to and uh, how you can get all those running using bento box the plugin the new plugin from uh, Poslovich and myself tasty bento stay tuned <music> The first thing that you need to do is actually copy the files over to your server. And here I have a server. This is actually running on my local laptop here. I have a 1.13 server running spigot and we have the plugins folder. So we just open up the plugins folder. Currently the only plugin that I have is Essentials X. And what we're gonna do is copy in the bento box jar file, which is the bento box plugin into that. After we've done that, we need to open up a terminal window and we're going to start the server. And there we go. You'll see that it's generated the bento box subfolder. And inside there we have the bento box config.yml that you can edit. And then we have the add-ons folder. We have a database folder that will be used for storing files if you're using the default YML database storage. And we have the local folder where all the various languages are that you can play with. Okay, so let's look at the add-ons folder. There's nothing in there right now. And BentoBox is a mix and match system so you can add or remove exactly what type of functionality you want. So let's put B Skyblock in there. And there are some other add-ons. These are add-on uh, files. Uh, the, they look at like plugins, but they're not. They're actually add-ons to BentoBox. So we have B Skyblock. I won't add Acid Island right now, but uh, you can also add challenges, for example. Let's put challenges in there. And once you've done that, then you should restart the server. So let's stop the server, and then we'll restart it again. BentoBox has created two subfolders. We have the B Skyblock folder and the Challenges folder. Inside this folder, we have the config file. If we open up the config file, you'll see that you've got the various settings for B Skyblock that you can change and edit how you like. And similarly, in the Challenges folder, we have a config and some challenges that we can play around with. And if we go back to the to the server, it actually has loaded two add-ons here. And if we do bento box version, it will show the various game modes that have been loaded and the add-on versions here. That is now a running server. So if I am going to uh, play this, I can log in and play it. So this is just the default world. So let's do island. And there we go. That's all there is to it, folks. You can add additional add-ons how you like by just adding them to the add-on folder. Uh, if you want to run Acid Island at the same time, you can do that. So you can just drag in Acid Island to the add-ons folder and restart the server. There we go, we're in Acid Island. Thanks for watching.